Good morning everyone and welcome back to our channel today. I am just in the car right now with my Uber driver. Yeah, best Uber driver out there. He's making me sit in the front seat and I don't I know. know why. We are opening up today's video in the car in a bunch of traffic yeah. as you can see. The real reason we are in the car is pretty exciting. If you watched yesterday's video, I mentioned I found a new OBGYN, which I'm so excited about and so grateful that they could get me in before we head to Utah here. And all of this went down yesterday. I know, everything's kind of falling into place super quickly. And so we're on our way to that office right now. It is about a 40 minute drive, so it's pretty far, but it's a very well-known doctor. And the exciting thing is, you guys, if we do end up getting pregnant, this is the office and the doctor that will be delivering our baby, <laughs> which is really exciting. Baby bingo. I know. So a while ago when I did have that chemical pregnancy, and obviously that did not end up going through, but when I did think I was pregnant, I was actually able to schedule an appointment with them, and so I was already in the system, so that is how they are getting me in, because I'm yeah. technically I was already in the system. is at her appointment. Finn and I decided to get, go out on a little walk just near this place and I gotta say this place is unreal cool. It's like right next to this massive pond, lake, I don't even know what you call this thing. I mean it connects with like other waterways and whatnot but it's like got restaurants and everything literally right on this thing. We got fountains in the background. It's pretty cool. Not a bad place to go walk the pup. Brittany literally walked out with the biggest smile on her face. You guys, I can't tell you how good it feels to find a doctor that you just get along with and, you, yeah. and you're like on the same wavelength, you feel like heard and recognized and validated. Yep. Like, it was incredible. So I met with a doctor, her name was Tyler, and she was incredible. I told her all my history, told her everything that's happened, and she was like documenting everything, got a pap smear, and the cool thing was, is I told her how we had an appointment with a fertility specialist coming up in Utah here pretty soon. She's like, let's go ahead, and I'm gonna run quite a few tests that I know they're gonna wanna run, but this way, you guys, it's under insurance. Which, which is, is awesome. Great, so I got a few orders, so she's gonna be running some blood work, which I've had this done, it's been almost two years now, but she's like, let's just get it all updated, it'll be awesome. So I need to go in actually coming up this Saturday and I'm gonna get my prolactin, LH, FSH, and TSH levels all checked. Now I've had these checked in the past and they've all been great, which is really good. So hopefully no changes there. But then she's also gonna have me go back in and get my blood work done for progesterone. Now that is the one thing that I have usually found that I am low in. So we'll see how this goes. I'm not on Clomid right now. I haven't been for a couple months. So it's gonna be just like my levels off of everything, which will be really great. And then, we also <laughs> got a test for Jared. Woo -woo. So it's been a while since he's been checked. Yep. And so we got a test to take, and we actually have to take this into an IVF clinic yep. to get the full analysis. So Jared's gonna be doing this. He's got some homework to do <laughs> as well. But that way, we'll have like all of our updated tests. They'll yep. literally be done the week before we go in for our specialist appointment. Guys, this is awesome. It could not be better timing with everything. It's I, all just falling together. I finally feel like, yeah, I just have a doctor on my side. I mean, you guys, ever since we moved here to Florida, I've just been seeing a doctor virtually. Yeah. And it just hasn't been the best experience. So finding someone, literally the week before we go into this special yeah. appointment. So having someone here in Florida on our side and then going to the fertility specialist next week, having someone in like that's their specialty, I yeah. just feel like I know. things are lining finally <laughs> lining up for us and I feel this so awesome. great. And she was so sweet. She's like, we're gonna make it happen one way or the other. Like I know it's super stressful and Anyways, you guys, that was just like the best appointment ever, so. <laughs> yeah. It was awesome, and hats off this sweet guy. He wanted to come in, I told him, I mean, I've been into it. You know, BG Wines, this is just like kind of 
standard, you know, just to get me enrolled in everything. Yeah. So he didn't come and he waited with little Finn. They went on a yeah. walk and stuff. But now I'm off to my next appointment. <laughs> so I'm actually going to get my roots all touched up, you guys, because we, while we were out in Utah, we have family photos. Yeah. And so I need to get these touched up. So Jared's dropping me off here. And I'll probably see you in what, three, four hours? All right. See you all right. Never. So next time you guys see me, <laughs> I'm going to be nice, bright, and blonde. All right, guys, while Brittany is getting her hair done, I decided to go take the car to get its oil change. And while I was getting its oil change, I took Finn out on a very much needed long walk for like 20, 30 minutes. And it was so much fun because he's running all throughout the grass. He was having an absolute blast. I think I totally tuckered him out. So I thought, you know what? I'll take him back to the house. And while he's resting, I'd go get the car wash. And I just got it back. And it's looking pretty darn good. It looks nice. I gotta admit, it looks pretty darn clean in here. I have not seen the tires shine as much as they do right now. They are looking really nice. I also removed all the trash, vacuumed it myself, gathered up our belongings. Feels great to have a nice clean car for the weekend. Check out the sunset right now with the pinks and blues. And looking over here, I think, I don't know if there's a rocket launch on schedule today, but that looks like one off of the distance there. See that little white strip right in the middle there? Well, that's typically where the rockets take off from. And if you follow it up, you can see, yeah, that is definitely a rocket, you guys. Oh my gosh. You guys are literally looking at a rocket taking off from over at NASA, and we're watching it live right this second. This is incredible. So I just confirmed it, you guys. This is actually a full-on rocket launch that is happening right this second. Oh my gosh, you can actually see it landing. Okay, this is cool. I gotta zoom in here for you. So this is the landing of the first stage booster. That's what they were saying. You see that like thing that looks like a star way off in the distance? Well, that's the rocket returning back to the launch pad over at SpaceX. So I'm watching the live feed coverage right now on SpaceX's site, and this is nuts. It basically lands at supersonic speed. That thing's landing with like exact precision. Oh, that's so cool how it falls down like that. Stage two is the thermal guidance. So apparently a SpaceX rocket launched at sunset and I was trying to capture it as best I could, but it made it into space and then the first phase actually landed and that's what you guys saw right there on the live feed coverage. I cannot believe I just randomly saw that as I came out to watch the sunset from our balcony. Like that is so cool. Oh my gosh. It's time for the official release of Britney's hair. Oh my god. Ooh. What a difference. It does look a lot better though. It looks really nice. I mean, I'm definitely blonde, you guys. More blonde. I like I got it a lot. the blonde going on for yeah, sure. Yeah. I'm so excited. It feels it always feels good to get your hair done. I know. You know? It feels so soft and silky and smooth and Yeah, I like the really little bright. like style you got I going think on it there too. Super bright compared to the background of the sky right now, <laughs> the darkness. It looks really, really good. And look at this gorgeous night. It's almost yeah. like a full moon, I feel like. The moon is so bright tonight. It is way bright. It's so just reflecting off the ocean right there. The ocean, on the inner coast. Yeah, there's some unreal. It's going by, you guys, with Christmas lights, and it's getting us excited Yee! for Saturday because Saturday is the famous Fort Lauderdale boat parade, which is so I fun. know. You guys are going to have to come back. We might even have to do like a live. I don't know. It kind of depends with well, the lighting. Yeah, we'll have to. It's kind of hard to see at night. But you guys, we have a front row seat to it. It's literally yeah. goes by right here. So we're And we can just walk out there. Jared also told me about the rocket launch that happened today. <laughs> I know. That? that was kind of crazy. I just came out here to see the sunset and all of a sudden it was just boom right boom, over there. Rocket. <laughs> boom. Lighted a boat. <laughs> Boom, new hairdo. Long hair. <laughs> yeah, it does look really good. It's a, it is a slightly darker in real life than maybe it's just in the show. Let me yeah, show maybe. Inside. Okay. There we go, you guys. It's real not life. Like <laughs> Malfoy from Harry Potter. <laughs> yeah. Then no, that looks really good though. And it'll go down a little bit. When yeah, it gives it a spin. I'm not gonna give it a spin. Come on. <laughs> you guys, today has been such a good day though. Yeah. Especially 
started out better. And also I've had a chance to talk to you guys since our video went live. And thank you for all the sweet comments, the love. Yeah. Because so many people, obviously I know so many people go through anxiety. Both Jared and I know that for sure. But it's just awesome to read your guys' sweet messages, your love. It just means the world. So thank you, thank you. Yep, guys, coming to you from both of us. We love you. Yes, we love you guys so much. We love our internet family here. Thank you for hanging out with us today. I think we're, oh look, we're matching. How did I, I just realize that we're both in black shirts? Yeah. Well, I just have some part to or, yeah. That's for sure. But we love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with us and we'll see you all tomorrow. See you guys, love you. Bye. Bye.